Good morning, Matusai from uh, EM Tech Global. I uh, hope you're doing well. Hi, my name is Charles Marine over at uh, your local SEO professionals. I'm uh, located here in Philadelphia. Um, I, want to shoot, I wanted to shoot you this quick video after doing some quick research on your website. Um, I'm gonna shoot, this video I'm gonna shoot right now will basically go over your website seeing what's working well and looking over what your competition does and what works well for them and then i'm going to give you guys three tips on um, on what you can use or implement today to help bring in more uh, traffic to your website and therefore more customers and also hopefully dominate your competition online um, first why am i doing this i found that by giving people a free attack plan um, of actual things you can do to get your website ranked. Um, it results in some of these businesses that I'm helping out uh, coming back to me and saying, hey, Charles, would you do this for me? Um, so if by the end of this video, you like what you he you've heard and you can see I've got a couple of tricks up my sleeve, uh, shoot me a message um, and we can chat. Or if at the end of this video, you simply want to just take this advice um, that works for me too, as long as uh, I'm into helping local businesses. Um, this guy Zig Ziglar once said, you can get what you want if you help enough people get what they want. And um, that's my that's my mode of operation. Okay, so let's get started. Let me get into it. Let me go over to your website. Um, so there are three things I'm going to focus on that will set your company above the competition. These are content, citations, and backlinks. These are the three most important things when it comes to ranking your website and bringing on new customers for your services. All right, so let's look at your site. Let's talk about content first. Basically, this is anything on your front page. All uh, text that you can see, and also um, including pictures, and what the pictures are saved as, and also what's behind the pictures, um, all that is included as content. Um, this is why it's important for you to, to make sure you have unique authoritative content right on your front page. It explains very clearly what you do and um, how to get in touch with you guys and what you offer and who you are. And uh, then also being able to add in some key words or key phrases or key terms that people are going to be using to try and search for you guys. Um, for example, when I was searching for you guys on um, on Google, I um, like a key phrase, a, key, a keyword I would use would be data analytics Philadelphia or cloud services Philadelphia or IT services Philadelphia. And I was hoping to be able at least to see you on the front page. And fortunately, I did not. Um, but that's what we're talking about, how to get you onto this front page of, um, of Google. One thing about Google, um, the, the way to rank your page, um, you guys need to have at least 1,500 words to be optimized with Google on your front page. And using, let me pull up a free tool. Um, it's called Word Counter. Um, here. I'll put in your website and let's count number of uh, words that you have here on your front page. You only have 240 words at this front page. So it would be good to beef up your content to get to the range of about three, uh, sorry, a thousand to 1500. Um, if we look at your competitors, like now I searched here uh, on Google for data and well, let's go for uh, IT services, Philadelphia. Um, a competitor, all these are ads. You can see um, here, dataprize.com. That's one of your competitors. Okay. I'm going to grab their website and put it into the word counter. This is a reason why they are ranking higher. They have, author oops, they have authoritative content and also have an optimized number of words on the front page. Um, I'm not sure why this website is not working. 
count words. Okay, the site is not working. I'm going to look for a different kind of word counter um, for web pages. Just to look at your competitors. Um, here we go. Oops. Okay, search boom. All right, here. Put in the competitor's website, perform a check. And you can see here the word count total will be about 1,655. So they're optimized um, for, actually it's 1,386. They're optimized for their content. Um, so that's pretty much the gist of what content is. Just want to make sure you guys have enough content, authoritative content to get all your keywords and key terms on this front page so that you, you're found by search engines. Second thing I want to go over, over is uh, citations. And um, just to go over citations, let's look at the search that I, I performed for IT services in uh, Philadelphia. Um, you see, as soon as I... Um, search for it services philadelphia those are the keywords the first thing you see are these ads at the top of the searches where you see ad the word um these are a hit or miss some people have ad blockers nowadays and uh, with ad blocker they won't even see these google ads um and they are expensive to buy from google so anyone who's running ads um could be missing a part of that of the market the one the people who have ad blocker uh, but the citation part I'm talking about has more to do with this map section over here. Um, usually, with uh, this is where people get phone calls and clicks to their website. Um, let's look. I search for data anal analytics as well. Um, and you'll see there's usually a map section. Um, here, let me, let me do this. Okay, yeah. So here you can see there's only one company on the map actually map section um but it's usually like if you search if i would search for um say plumber philadelphia um the section here is called the maps section um to get here means that your citations um basically citations are your business name and address and phone number exactly as they appear everywhere across the web in any directory citations are mostly um directories like facebook yellow pages yelp where anyone can any anyone can um put in their businesses and services and be listed in a directory now um to get to the top of this obviously you need many more citations um i use a tool called bright local to look up citations and um, taking your competitor data price i put them into my tool and i'm looking at all the, the business listings wherever they're uh, they're placed um, you can see brown book bing local uh, city search these are all different directories that um where they have placed their business information. And as you can see, it's exactly the same everywhere. Um, so what we would do in order to beat your competition here was that we'd get more citations for your website out on very many directories online. I did a little bit of research also with your site. And uh, the reason I'm not putting it up here is because I did not find um, any citations. Um, um, Let's move on to the third thing I want to talk about, which is backlinks. Now, the th um, backlinks have more to do with this, this organic search section. So when you search IT Services Philadelphia, you'll find the ads first and then the map pack. And then here, these are the organic listings. Um, and this is where I found DataPrice. So them, they're pretty high up the organic listing on the first page. This is where we want to get, get you. So to give you an example of what a backlink is, is um, so say you did a great job for someone um, and they go on on their website or their um, they shout you out online on their blog or something saying, hey, these guys, uh, EM2 Tech Global did a great job for us. Um, and here's the link to them. And we trust these guys, and then they provide a link on their blog to you guys. That's what a backlink is. 
It's just another website linking back to your website. All that does is create another avenue for people to find you. So um, let's go back to your competitor. Let's go back to your competitor, um, the same one that I've been using so far, and let's take a look at the backlinks. Um, one second, I just want to find the website. Here we go. Um, you can see they have a lot of con authoritative content. Um, I use this tool called AREFs, and um, I am going to put in their website here. Let's see. And I'm going to take a look at their backlinks. Um, here you can see they have about a thousand referring domains linking back to the page 10,000 times. That's why the strength of the, the, the very high in, um, in Google searches. They have tons of backlinks. Um, and I took a look at your um, website here, and I only find two backlinks. And that, no, not just referring domains um, on the same page. Yeah, you have four, two referring domains, which um, give you four backlinks. And you can see that they're just uh, generic sites that have uh, basically maybe scraped your information and you're out there somewhere on their website with a link to your website. But the main thing I want to talk about is these backlinks because we, what you have to do is get enough different referring domains. And you can see here, I can come and look at your competitors. And all I have to do is go onto each of these and more to completely dominate your competitor. And um, another another interesting thing is to look at these keywords. Um, they have 8,000, uh, they rank for 8,000 keywords, bringing them in about 8,400 8, uh, clicks per month. Um, that's a really, really strong website. And if I click on the key keywords, you'll see that these are the main organic keywords that they're ranking for. That's given them power. Um, for example, they, um, let's see, IT consulting services, position four. So that means they're ranking on the fourth position, first page um, for that keyword. And so what our job would be was to go into your website and put in as many ranking keywords, um, get you connected to very many um, uh, is this, uh, backlinks, and help build your power, your authoritative power online. So in a nutshell, that's what backlinks, how backlinks work. Um, having relevant, unique backlinks pointing back to you from other relevant websites will increase your power. And even though this looks hard, this is very doable. You can become, um, you can become more powerful than this website here um, as EM Tech Global. So just to recap, the most important things that I've talked to you about when it comes to your website are content, citations, and backlinks, and uh, building them up. I hope this has been informative to you. Sorry, it, it ran a little bit over um, the 10 minutes which I had promised you. Well, I should say 10 to 15. But uh, I hope you've learned something from what I've said. I hope um, you're able to increase your traffic on your website. Um, if this is something you'd like to work with, with me on, um, feel free to send me a message. Uh, you can email me back anytime. Um, yeah, uh, if not, that's fine. Just take this advice and I hope it can help you um, build your business and attract more customers. Thank you. Once again, I'm Charles Marine and my phone number is 215-770-1621. Thank you.